Hi, so it's Thurs Thursday, it's going up. Yeah, this is going up on Thursday. What you are seeing is not what's going on right now. <laughs> so I'm like, what? Anyways, so I figured, you know, shirtless videos get a little bit more. I'll, I'll be tiny over in the corner. I need to, Aaron started playing Star Wars The Old Republic. Got everything going, there's the mini map, okay. So we're gonna start, everything's gonna shrink down. Here we are reacting to this. I've never really seen anyone play this recently. So, and I know a lot of things have changed. It's sort of like if you've watched someone play WoW back at the, like the beginning of Cataclysm, maybe the end of Wrath, and yeah. So, yeah, I don't know. Let's hit play at the beginning of the video here. Right, beginning of the video. And play! He has got a clown suit on. Those are some green pants! Flesh, Flesh Raider Death Watch Player. Did you telekinetic rocking? We'll call that telekinetic rock. I like that. Oh, look at that. Oh. More rock. Oh, lightsaber. Oh. You just thunder wave that shit. Is that what loot looks like? Yes. <laughs> Aaron, fuck. I guess that you can do that, throw a rock at its face and then bitch slap it. Did the guy fall off the cliff and die? Oh. Where's your life? Oh, there's a red thing down there. Green must be force. Or energy, whatever. It seems to be coming back to that again. Bam! Rock to the head. Back to the side. You're a hammerhead. You're a fat hammerhead. Ooh, money. Bam. Aaron said he's a consular or something. He went for random names, so Cholgoda, I guess. What? The guy just beat you upside the head. Oh, there's your quest up there. There's your loot. I'm like a boss. Low health. Oh. Like some weird Jedi meditating thing? Yeah, it looks like it. Um. Probably dumb of you to do, Aaron. Like, I'm an arcane mage. I wouldn't even do stuff at level. Well, you're handling it pretty well, I guess. Maybe you learned how to parry. I don't know if that's a if that's an active thing in the game. You gonna put your boots on? Endurance and willpower. Yes. That's just the soul bound. You cannot trade with us. Alright. Whoa! So you're thunder waving them. And then throwing a rock at their head. That's cool. I never see other things that engage. And Aaron has his graphics like all the way up, so. What's going on? I'm examining? Examine the bone idol. Boom! Out of range, move closer. At least on WoW, they're like, I need to get closer. I must say, the loot, saying there's loot in here is definitely a lot more visual. Sometimes it's hard to tell. It's been kind of, like, they had to add the sparkles in on WoW because people weren't noticing it. And Star Trek's kind of easy because it's exactly where the ship blew up, so. Ew, that's a, that's a clown suit. That's a. It's sort of like, you don't even quite have a lightsaber because it's a stick that glows, right? Did I just do glitch out? I could, whatever. Let's go after him, Aaron. 
the guy might be attacking you, I hear that. Mm. No? Kill as little as <laughs> possible. Boom! Like a significant cooling element of coal or whatever. It's technically the last way. I'm not sure what it's called. You have to kind of go things. Unless I'm just not finding the tooltips. Savage IO. Complaining to him, he plays just fine. When I'm playing with him, he overthinks. Growing all the thing there, and you are not a proc power. What? It's a royal beatdown going on here. Achievement completed. Python Wildfire? Did he buff you? Did you buff him? Your inventory's full. Hmm. Why'd you get rid of your old boots? And suddenly I have aggro on like eight things. And he's gotta tank them all. <laughs> oh god. Report to Master Ben Show. Wait, no. Ah. Get, get, get. Started. Or Master of Ben. Okay, looks like you got a bunch of things you gotta do. Just go report to people. Hearthing? Almost a pointless loading screen because it already loaded the village. Oh, it's a tutorial. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Use your. Yeah. Follow the path. Follow the path. Boing. Taxis. You are cleared for the following travel routes. Oh, taxis. Flight, hi. I've studied the Flesh Raiders' idols. Here are my notes. How are you, Magla Resesim? Put my toto jisa fin gruda sim ya sopa. Eg far kak sara ay for fast you. Gran yam 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 I 
you have two more quests to turn in there. He didn't jump as much on Star Trek. They're probably going to be out in the open. This is a tutorial. Best post exchange around. You need it, we got it. You have enough. Sell junk. That's a nice button. We definitely have enough to buy that stick now. Light foil. See the stat change there. Everything would go up. Buy it. More max damage. More min damage. More endurance. More willpower. More force power. Everything goes up there, but again, I mean, you just want an apprentice one or do you want an understudies one? Main hand. Main hand. Good luck out there. I mean, you always buy the one at the bottom of the list. <laughs> Unless it's sorted weird, and then you know, and you just kind of buy the most expensive one. I mean, later when you're min maxing stuff, you probably don't want to buy the most expensive needs, but Some things he doesn't. Good luck out there. Oh, he's gonna buy armor now. I think your armor is better, Aaron. Mm. Plus four armor, endurance, willpower. Okay, yeah. Wormy topi. Chuba the Maxa. Whatever you say, dude. Womi Topi. Womi Topi, whatever. That's. Now let's see if we can figure out where to turn in these quests. That's a mailbox, Aaron. Nah, I can see that. Maybe that guy in there is a quest turn in. It's blinking. Who are you? Oh, hello. You must be one of the Jedi. My name is Balea. How do you do? I don't mean to be rude, but I'd rather not talk for long. My daughter is very sick, and I'm all she has since my husband died. I found a hollow recording on your husband's body. He said these manga cat teeth would help your daughter. You brought these for my daughter? Oh, this is what the doctor needs to make her medicine. I, I'm overwhelmed. I don't know what to say. I am pleased I could help. I... You should be rewarded for this. Yes, uh... Wait, I know. Yes, you should have this. It was my husband's. It served him well, and... Now that you have saved my daughter's life, I hope it serves you well also. It's a weapon! Thank you so much. I've... I've got to tell the doctor right away so that he can make Russo's medicine. He just bought a weapon and he's gonna get another quest reward, isn't he? Oh no! Getting a belt. Togoda has reached level 7. And everything goes flying off into space. What does level 7 mean? Are you gonna figure it? Okay. 
So, it was on repeat. Anyways, so yeah, that's that. Um, that's, it's a starting experience. I wasn't expecting too terribly much, honestly. Um, hope I did a good job of reviewing it, reacting to it. I don't know. Anyways, you got to see someone play Star Wars The Old Republic from like 6 to 7. Mid 6 to mid 7, I don't know. I'm very critical of Aaron's gameplay. I'm sorry. I will check you guys tomorrow. 13. Yeah, tomorrow. Tomorrow is the 14th. So that's a one take Friday. It's probably like I'm probably cracked out on WoW right now as you guys are watching this and I'm recording myself just like or something like that. I don't know. I don't know right now. So yeah. Bye. These are the new milk chocolate dipped wavy lays. Uh, the bag is actually way heavier than I expected, although I'm not sure why I didn't expect it to be heavy, just they're covered in chocolate. Uh, they're limited edition, not sure how long they'll be around. Well, what I'm guessing and what Alyssa and I are guessing is it's like a test market thing and it's best to bring about milk chocolate stuff like that for the holidays. Because that's where they were, we found them in Target at the holiday section. So as you can see, they're chips covered in milk chocolate. Give me that one. Weird. Generally just one side of it.